Hi everybody. Uh, this is this is a hopefully short video for my long long time subscribers mainly, um, saying that yes, I'm still here and I am fully I, I fully intend to come back and be making lots of videos. Uh, but if indeed I succeed in that, the videos are just going to start coming as if. I've never been away. In other words, I, I, I can't make a coherent narrative out of, uh, I, 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 I've been, I've been trying, <laughs> I got problems here, dudes. Problems having to do with the whole vlogging conundrum. Um, and if I'm going to come back and do videos, they have to be the videos that I wanted to do in the first place and not videos about why I'm not making videos, and yet I seem to, I, I just am like, I have like brain lock on, on this desire to have some kind of continuity with the giant missing section of my YouTube history, but I can't, I can't. So when I start making videos again, it will just as be as if, well, you know, here's his new video, you know, it doesn't explain why he wasn't making them, and if uh, if I'm successful, it will be as if Metabob has no problem making YouTube videos. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? I hope you do because I'm just not going to re-record this. Um, the the other the other thing I just wanted to point out here is um, Shauna, aka Superlunary, aka the Queen of Planet Metabob. Uh, has come back to YouTube, um, and about three weeks ago, Shauna, I hope you're watching this, I'm, but I'm going to talk about you in the three, third person here, just just to get through this. Um, almost three weeks ago now, she did a, a little video saying, you know, what happened to the community, which of course resonates with my whole issue of what happened to me, why am I not on YouTube? And it just... It, it made me think about the fact that th there's really nothing unusual about me falling uh, away from YouTube. It's the most common YouTube story, uh, at least it, as far as I can see. Uh, I'm subscribed to 429 channels, of which almost 400 must be vloggers. And of those almost 400, I doubt if 40 of them, of you, still make videos even semi-regularly. So there are like, you know, hundreds and hundreds of stories just within my subscriptions. Uh, stories of why people got onto YouTube and then stopped making videos. Um, so it's the most common experience. In Shauna's case, Shauna, dear Shauna, oh my god, Shauna, <laughs> speaking of you in the third person, for the rest of you who are behind the my imaginary Shauna that I'm looking at in this camera lens right now, uh, Shauna, uh, uh, used to be like the the perfectly situated YouTuber because she had a job where she had to sit in an office that was uh, uh, deserted most of the time and just hold down the front desk in front of a webcam so she could just make videos to fill fill her time. But now Shauna uh, works six days a week, 18 hours a day in a coal mine and has better things to do with her tiny bit of free time than make YouTube videos. But even before that change, Shauna, you were, you were the first YouTuber that I ever subscribed to who abruptly closed her channel. And then you came back. And then you had to close your channel because you lost the job and you didn't even have your own computer. It, what, what's my point? That sounds accusatory. I'm not being accusatory. I'm just saying that this the YouTube is like this weird blessing and curse all mixed together, um, like all blessings and curses. And it's it's 
in, in the American dream, people reaching for that, uh, that a wonderful thing that looks so bright and shiny and exciting, and then it, it's either disappointing or you can't grab it. And the YouTube experience is a little bit like that. I, hands down, the best thing that has happened to me from YouTube is getting to know Shauna, who I would never have met uh, any other way. She lives on the other side of the country, 3,000 miles away. She's 20 years younger than me, and uh, and it matters to me as much as it should matter to whoever. You know, all these things, there were all these separations. She's got a, some kind of real-life boyfriend, <laughs> you know, uh, et cetera, et cetera, whatever. Um, but it's a... Uh, it's a special connection that I hope is not going to fall away the same way that YouTube um, is always seems to always seems to be in danger of souring. Lastly, thank you to everyone who left comments on my last two videos about Dan and Zelda. Uh, and of course, I didn't respond to anyone's comments. Um, The, the worst, if, if Shauna was the best thing to come from YouTube to me, uh, the worst thing is, is YouTube somehow catalyzed just the worst case of, of write, a, aversion to writing that I have ever known. There are, there are famous people, not just uh, insignificant people like me, but famous people who you know, who were famous for writing, who one day just hit a writer's block that stopped them dead for the rest of their lives. I sure hope that it hasn't happened to me because I'm, um, I'm just really, I have to get, I have to get back to writing. Um, oh man. Anyway, um, but the, uh, what was my point? Thank you for for all of your kind words on the last two videos, and especially to um, uh, Walter Walter Shermitz, I've never known how to pronounce your YouTube name, and um, and also to my my mysterious redheaded stepchild Metacrocken, who both made videos to me that I didn't even respond to. <sighs> anyway. I, I'm, I'm not apologizing, I'm just saying thank you. The reason I'm not apologizing is I've made many videos apologizing for how I don't respond, and everyone keeps telling me don't apologize. And also because it ain't going to change anytime soon. I, if, I, if I suddenly solve all of my problems with responding to people, with inter... with, with, with back-and-forth communication, then you know, just pretend I didn't say this, but at the moment expect that my channel will be much more me putting stuff out there and just, no, I'm really gonna, I'm really gonna do it this time. And they will be about issues and poetry and things and drama and movies and whatever, but, but not about what's wrong with me.